Captain on the bridge. All right, Captains, we are back on the bridge. And today, yes, we will be going over how to get your free Experian Battle Intel Cruiser from the summer event. So on screen. Yes, Captains, before we get into this video, do us a huge favor. Hit that like button. Also, if you're new here, welcome. Consider subscribing here to the YouTube bridge as we're always on the lookout for like-minded Captains where we can share our love, our passion, for Star Trek Online, but also things Star Trek. Now that said, here we go. Captains, today is the day. We are finally back at Ryza for our summer event. We're just here in orbit. So what we're gonna do in this video, Captains, is show you how we do our daily to get our progression towards getting this summer's 2023 event summer ship, which is the Hyperion Intel Battle Cruiser. So put this on here. Just a couple tips before we start going here. So if you go under your events tab here and seasonal summer, especially if you're new here, of course, to Star Trek Online, welcome captain. This is your easy, easy access to getting to Ryza. This is gonna be up for the whole duration of the event. And as you can see here, captains, we just need to get a progress of 20 to get this, which is of course, we've gone over it already in nauseum, which is the Hyperion Intel Battle Cruiser. Of course, we look at the image here. There she is. We can't wait to have some fun with this. We already have some ideas on what we're gonna do with this, but all in all, it is just gonna be for fun. And I'm super glad that this is a free reward, essentially. And one of the quickest ways to get this is the summer events that we're gonna show you here. So again, that is that so what we're going to do here is just beam down you get here in orbit all you want to do is go beam to classic beach and or again use the transwarp all good it will get you to where you need to go now if you're new and you don't have the floater and we went to the wrong one not the classic we need to go to the other one not the classic beach so excited that I, I hit the wrong one. I'll try it again. Round two. Round two. So we need to go to the resort. Sorry. Summer resort. Clicked on the wrong one. So excited. Okay. This will bring you to the dock area there. Now, we have one of the fastest floaters here. You're going to have to do the events. We recommend just doing some of the events there. And you can kind of do all of that stuff here that we've gone over. But once you have enough of the favors, you want to, at least for now, before you actually get that, you want to rent at least this of a thousand. And then when you have enough of the favors, you can start with these slow ones, the standard ones. They're pretty slow. And then, of course, the more faster they get, the more expensive they do get. And of course, with the superior being the one that is the fastest or impulsive. Now the impulsives give you a plus 70 with the superiors kind of plus 50. So the impulsive are the actual ones that are the fastest. Now we have on us the impulsive, so we have the fastest one. But if you're starting off the event, just go ahead and get the rental here. You're gonna to have to do it every time you do it. But again, as you do more summer, summer events, the more favors you get, the more you can spend to do this. So this is very, very quick. And once you get your floater, of course, all you gotta do is drag it into your tray here. If not already, it doesn't come automatically. You can just click on the top right corner of your tray there and then just scroll down, look for it, right click it and hold it. And there you go, drag it anywhere you need to. Now to control the floater, all you gotta do is click on it. Okay, now you're gonna be just using W, A, D, S, W to forward, S backwards, A and D to kind of just turn right. Now hold your left mouse to kind of direct yourself while you're flying. Now the easiest way that I do this, and then of course spacebar is actually your your jump your jump there. You're not jump, you're you're rising there. 
you get up. Now, if you want to just go down, just point down, and then just, again, use W. And you can do that again, and there you go. So, what you want, there's a fellow captain there. Shout out to Karita, right there. So, again, what you're going to do, and again, you can just turn that off here. The best way to do this is in shooter mode. And all you gotta do is press B, and this actually comes up. Now, when you're in B mode in your Resident Floater mode, hit B, that's gonna come up. Now, all you gotta do is just move your mouse and wherever you're pointing, that is where you're gonna be going. It's the easiest way to do, and you can still use your jump, your space bar to go up, and that'll be the easiest. So, and when you do the daily here, and then if you wanna get out of shooter mode, you just press B again. You're gonna go to this lady here, of the event coordinator fly. Time's wasting. and you want to do the flying high event you've seen the floaters in the sky we've set up some holographic challenges to test your agility once you're strapped in take off and keep an eye out for our holographic rings fly through the various ring courses and you'll earn the approval of onlookers and hopefully impress the judges you learn a higher score by completing various sets of rings. So if you see a group of rings around a landmark or over a building, try to get through all of them. There you go. And of course, you get 50 favors. So again, you can even use this to get you build up your favors and then buy your floaters and then keep going up from there. So once you accept, get out there and fly. What I love to do is just kind of run off the ramp here and then press my floater. But anyways, once you accept, you're going to get a random set of holographic courses to go through once you fly off. So, come up here, then you're going to hear that sound, and then now you're going to just look at your mini-map and to find out where they are. And usually you just got to, again, go hit your B button. All you got to do is go look for them. You do have a time limit. You have nine minutes to do so. But this, again, this is very quick. Usually it's right there, but this is always going to be random. So you just follow on your minimap there where they're going to be. Again, hit B and you're going to be in shooter mode. This is the easiest way and all you got to do is hit W to go forward and you'll fly out there. Again, this is the fastest one that they have here in terms of floaters. Once you find it, of course, it's going to send me all across. There you go. Once you find it, look for the start button. Of course, the arrow is going to show you where to start. And you just fly through. Nothing crazy. And then with your mouse, it's easy. Even easier if you probably have your controller. And done. Just like that, that's one. Now we have to Don't go find the other two. You just got to do three. That's it. It will give you multiple ones, but you just got to find the ones that are closest to you. And of course, the time that we decide to do this video, they're going to be the farthest apart from us. Usually they're there at the actual resort itself. But again, this is one of my favorite events because you get to do this. You get to fly around. For some reason, this is so common to me. So you got your one course there. Other than there, so we'll do this one first and then we'll double back to that one. Or I think we'll do the one there on top of the lighthouse. So, again, all you got to do is point and fly. Easy peasy. Again, I am showing you how I do this, and I've been doing this for years. This is the, one of my favorite ways to do it, That's and the one of the fastest ways of hikers. getting. Your daily. So yeah, we got the lighthouse here. So this one, you just gotta keep going around a circle around the lighthouse. There. Fly there. And you can use your space bar to go up. Oh, missed that one. Missed that one. There you go. Don't scare the birds. There you go. Time Done. Too much. The timer was at seven minutes. So that took two minutes, three minutes at max. And I still had to fly around the island, essentially the other side. Now, 
one of the good things that you can do here now you can get on shooter mode just press b is you have a site to site transport in case you are on the other side of the island you can do that just beam to resort It'll automatically bring you to where you beam down once you're here just fly over to the event coordinator again talk to event coordinator i hope you had a fun flight Continue. There you go. You get your daily and the 50 favors right there. And then it resets, of course, for every 20 hours. So again, but you can actually keep running this if you want to every 11 minutes. So there's an option too if you want to build up your favors. That is one way to do it. It'll take you probably four minutes if you have the standard floater the one that you ran for a thousand EC but as you can see when you get up to the impulse it takes even if I had to fly all that distance it's it took less than four three minutes to do so easy peasy way of doing it and again we are for this year we're getting this awesome awesome ship that we're gonna get here as the prize and we could not be more excited again captains that is how we do our daily so we thought we would share it with you especially if you're new here to the youtube bridge there, so there you go captain's easy easy way of getting your daily just by doing the floater event and boom you're done in less than three minutes and so it's one of the quickest quickest actual dailies here in Star Trek Online and for us one of the funnest because it is relaxing after a long day it just feels really nice to just kind of fly over Risa no real care in the world and of course working towards an awesome awesome looking prize I know a lot of people don't like it but that's fine we are going to enjoy it we're going to collect it we're going to put it in our collection of ships to enjoy and once we get it captains know that we're going to share what we got. we have our ideas but we're going to share that here on the youtube bridge so that is the video just a quick show of how we do it some of our tips and tricks captains hit that like button comment below let us know what you do other than this for your daily and of course subscribe here to the youtube bridge and we will leave it on this note live long and prosper